We're going to uh, work with this magnet slide here. And uh, this came out of uh, Johnson Center Spanish. Uh, I think it's like the, anything from the fourth edition on up. Uh, talks about service tools and how the magnet uh, charger uh, can recharge flywheel magnets that are on the flywheel or the rotor magnets that are on like the, the uh, TNs and uh, some of the other small mercuries that have the scintilla rotary magnet that's on, uh, on the boat side. And there's really just a couple of components. There's a, a north a polarity switch and a, a operation button. And then you have your uh, uh, shoes here that, that match with uh, uh, the heels of the, of the magnets. And where you want to put those heels is right here, where the edges are at. And uh, first thing you got to do, first thing you got to do is locate which uh, magnet is north and which magnet is south. Because when you attach it to the magnet charger, um, north goes to south, south goes to north. So they have to match up just right that when you hit the button, it throws that charge. Um, so the way you find out which one is which is you take a uh, um, compass. And this one, this is the red is the north uh, charge, the black is the south charge. So the south is pointing to the north magnet. That's the way they work. The opposites attract. So this is the north magnet. So I put a little hand on it. And when I bring it over here to this, uh, I gotta get the balance on the right. This shoe is the north, it's pointing to south, so this is the south magnet. So now, when we match this up with the heels, we want to flip this over. This is north, this is south, so this has to be south, and this is north. So you look at your chart. With the polarity switch on the end, this is south and this is north. So that's the best this is the correct way you want to do it. No, actually, we attach the flywheel, make sure that the magnet heels touch. And you just touch it for like a second. And sometimes one second will do it, but I like to do it quite a few times. Just four or five times. You don't want to push it down and hold it. You'll burn this in. You can't find it. So, a couple of hits, you can see it's working. Because the, the compass is working its way over. And then, uh, you can see that it's a little harder to get off. Then you can take the screwdriver and kind of feel the hole. And this one I might have to hard. This one I have to flip over because it's, this is north and this is south. Other way around on that one, so I'm going to flip it over. Put it on there. This one I've already done this. So I'm just going to do it a couple times. This one I have to This is even turning. <laughs> yep. Now this one, I've already got the north and the south, but now what I got to do, you notice that the magnets are on opposite ends. These come off, 
These you can loosen up and rotate out. And you can see that by flipping this thing around in different different ways and different lengths, it can go in or out farther just by putting up the. the, the, the uh, isn't there also one that's in the center also? And they use the inside of the shoe. Mm -hmm. Those are the the uh, TDs. The inside yeah. Road, yeah. Road comes out. Yeah. Yeah. And they turn it. It's like that. We don't have one here. I'll pass that around. You guys can see. Uh, yeah.